This is a quick review on To Kill a Mockingbird, which is adapted from Harper Lee's To Kill a Mockingbird, a novel of 1960. So, this particular film, To Kill a Mockingbird, was released in 1962 and directed by Robert Mulligan, starring Gregory Peck, Mary Badham, Philip Alford, John Migna, Ruth White, Paul Fix, Brock Peters, Frank Overton, and certain other prominent actors of the time. Also, we see that this particular uh, film is centering around an uh, event that has taken place in the uh, fictional town Maycomb in Alabama. We see Atticus Finch playing a crucial role who has been positioned as a lawyer in this particular film. And Atticus Finch is a widowed father in his personal life, having two children, Jim Finch and Scout Finch. So in this particular film, uh, we see that he is defending Tom Robinson, who is a black man, accused or we can say wrongly accused of raping a white woman named Myela Violet Evil. But certainly if we talk about the acclamation and recognition of this film, it has received global uh, applause and also certain awards like Golden Globe Award, Academy Award for Best Writing. And it is also said to be a coming-age novel that addresses racism, prejudices, rigid social conventions, unlawful uh, unlawful actions and events. So, talking about the title of both the book and the film, we see that there is a reference to the Mockingbird. So, Mockingbird basically is a melodious bird who has a very soothing and uh, joyous voice that actually allows any being to suddenly leap up to a very happier mode, very meditative mode, very solemn mode. So, now while this film suggests of killing a mockingbird, it hints on the fact that there is a destruction of that good spirited bird, where in reality uh, we can say that evil takes over innocence. Now this particular film has done a great great job when it comes to adapting the book that was published in 1960 by Harper Lee. So Harper Lee is an American novelist who won Pulitzer Prize for the 1960 novel To Kill a Mockingbird and the film adaptation brought further success and acclaim to this particular book. The film received a global recognition and was a box office success as we all know that it has been also rated 8.2 in IMDb. So uh, in my opinion the two most important characters that is jean louis e. Scout Finch and her brother Jim Finch does a remarkable job. So for me, this particular film stands out when it comes to cinematography, the character portrayal, the character strengths, and definitely the acting. So as I see that this timeline is set in the 1930s in the fictional town created by Harper Lee, Maycomb, Alabama. So the family of Finch is uh, playing a very important role when it comes to me as a reviewer. So I see that this particular family is having also a housekeeper named Carl Purnia. Who takes modest care of uh, the widowed father Atticus Finch's two children, Jem Finch and Scout Finch. And also, uh, for me, this film stands out in terms of the uh, character of Atticus Finch being a lawyer who is to defend a black man named Tom Robinson. And definitely, these events and actions and how far he is able to stand out both as a father and a lawyer uh, makes this uh, film all the more a greater. Uh, distinguishable element. I would uh, personally recommend this film as it stands out in terms of cinematography, relatability, bindness and acting. This particular film has taken the setting of Maycomb situated in Alabama and has beautifully portrayed the south of the 1930s. It is uh, for me, more of a mystery film or you can see a timeless classic that explores prejudices, rigid conventions, social limitations and definitely the risks associated with a person why, when he or she is not abiding law. Also, on the other hand, what makes this film more striking to me is the straightforward narration and character's role which constantly expands throughout the film. And not only does it create a new conversation much different from the book and uh, development in terms of action, but it also does not devoid 
the intention of Harper Lee's book, plot and setting. So that what comes out to be a proper box office success and definitely I wouldn't talk much about the uh, climax and the further events. So what I will request is just uh, go and watch this movie. It's available. So and if you have certain additions and reviews and comments, please post it on in the comment box. Thank you all.